The kindness of little fox. In the heart of a lush forest, there lived a curious young fox named Finn. He was known for his playful antics and boundless energy, but deep down, Finn harbored a kind heart. One sunny morning, as Finn frolicked among the wildflowers, he stumbled upon a small badger named Rosie, her eyes brimming with tears. Asked Finn, his concern evident in his voice. Whatever is the matter, Rosie? Rosie sniffled, her tiny nose twitching. She whispered, her voice trembling. I've lost my way home. I don't know how to find my burrow. Finn's heart swelled with compassion as he looked upon the lost badger. Without hesitation, he vowed to help her find her way home, no matter the obstacles they faced. Together, Finn and Rosie ventured deeper into the forest, their bond growing stronger with each passing moment. Along the way, they encountered a wise old owl perched atop a gnarled oak tree. Hooted the owl, his eyes glittering with wisdom. Who, who goes there? Finn explained their predicament, his voice filled with determination. The owl nodded sagely, imparting words of encouragement and guidance to the young travelers. Through tangled thickets and babbling brooks, Finn and Rosie pressed onward, their spirits buoyed by the kindness they shared. As the sun began to set, they stumbled upon a winding path that seemed to lead nowhere. But Finn refused to lose hope. With unwavering resolve, he urged Rosie to follow him, trusting in the goodness of their hearts to light the way. And then, as if by magic, they stumbled upon Rosie's burrow, nestled beneath the shade of an ancient oak tree. Joyous tears filled Rosie's eyes as she bid farewell to her newfound friend, gratitude overflowing in her heart. As Finn watched Rosie disappear into the safety of her burrow, a warm glow spread through his chest. In that moment, he realized the true power of kindness, the ability to brighten even the darkest of days and guide lost souls back home. And so, with a heart full of gratitude and a spirit renewed, Finn returned to the forest, his laughter ringing out like a melody in the wind.